fan support remains high. Five News reporter Rachel Williams shows us that fans will call the hogs no matter what. Dixon Street was packed with hog fans to watch the big game, but it wasn't the outcome they hoped for or expected. I was just happy to, you know, see some of those guys go out with at least a bang in the Sweet 16. So, I mean, top 16 teams, it's, that's pretty good. I mean, you're better than a lot of teams out there. JJ's Grill was a packed house for Thursday night's game. The manager says regardless of the outcome, today was a win for the restaurant. So with it being spring break with the university, we if we weren't playing in the game this week, there'd be nobody here. So with us, the further we get, the more people want to be here. They want to be as close to as many Razorback fans as they can. Razorback fans still got to watch a good game and enjoy great food. Usually it's like chicken wings, chicken strips, like because there's nothing that goes with beer in a basketball game the way the chicken wings does. But right behind it, I would probably say our cheese fries are the most popular thing that people order here. With the season coming to an end, the Hog fans are hopeful they'll return to the NCAA tournament again. I don't hope. I know we're going to go to the Elite Eight again. Hopefully we go to the Final Four. So I expect him to go out there, hit it hard, and find some guys to come in and, and do some damage next year and try and get better than what we were last year, this year and years in the past. Hogs are done dancing. The Arkansas women's basketball team will play Friday night at Bud Walton Arena at 7 p.m. in the WNIT tournament. But for now, I'm in Fayetteville, covering news where you live. Rachel Williams, 5 News.